Ladies and gentlemen, it's Daily Games time. We've been talking conspiracy theories, British monarchy, Gumars, uh, the fact that Catherine is probably dead or getting surgery, but let's just, let's just get out of here and get our brains moving. Today is March 12th, Rochelle's birthday. If you're watching this on YouTube, comment happy birthday, Rochelle, on the gaming channel, which she assuredly doesn't watch, but I'll look at it and I'll be happy. Uh, starting with Gamedle. Let's get a Gamba, mayhaps? For the mods, the order will be Game Dull, NYT Mini, NYT Strands, Connections, Time Guesser. Great way to keep the video monetized. Did I say something gnarly? I Dead is fine, right? I could have said way worse. <laughs> way worse. Oh, see, look at chat saying happy birthday. Chat's in on it. I'm betting all my money on Gollum. That <laughs> I don't think you know how this game works. That would be crazy. Get your predictos in. One minute Gamba up. You do not have much time chat. 50 seconds. Only talking about the death of a monarch in the first five seconds. I'm sure it'll be fine, but if it's flagged, I'm not fighting it. That's fair. <laughs> hey, that's fair. Before you start, how long did you see those lights for? Oh, that, this was terrible. I had talked about it on my YouTube video about it, <laughs> but his knee in my crotch was way worse than the lights. I feel like uh, he bruised my uh, nuts. I slayed the mini good one today. Ugh, that, that makes me worry. It was worth it, though. It was very funny. I got sub-30, and I believe Stance can, too. <gasps> okay. Finally, we're back. All right. Gambas are in. Let's guess the game by the cover. Oh. What is this? He's got, like, a scroll. This isn't Fable 2. It's got kind of, like, a dark, scary background. One average guess attempts? Do people know this? Is this is this obvious? Uh, what was that? No. Shit, I don't know what this is. Who makes an evil game cover? Red? This is crazy. I feel like games, they gotta be blue and orange. <laughs> Just like movie posters in the 2010s. And late aughts. I got an arm. I have like a gauntlet with studs looking like he bought it at Hot Topic. Some kind of scroll. Some kind of this. What if this is uh, World of Warcraft? But it's um, an expansion. And that's how they're going to get me. What if this... So it's not Legion, which is green. Cataclysm, I think, has a dragon on the top. But this could be straight up the Burning Crusade. No, because that's pandas. This could be Warlords of Draenor guess me oh that's gross wait it is a role-playing rpg adventure game for windows so this is a, an elf i'm looking at presumably there's people being hung in the background oh okay it's it's a role-playing game where you play a i wonder if this is an elf or a dark elf what kind of elf would be on this, like, Road to Redemption? This is like a John Wick-esque elf game. Which does nothing for me. Oh, that does absolutely nothing for me. It's probably rated M for Mature, based on the fact that people are hanging in the background. Or what if... Do you know... Have you guys ever played the game Silent Hill? In Silent Hill, there's, like, guys with, like, a funny-shaped head. And this could just theoretically be the back of a funny-shaped head. Uh, what about Kingdom Under Fire? Did you guys ever play that game? Uh, not Kingdom Under Fire, what was it called? Maybe it was. Shit, what was that game called? With Gerard and the Night Elves. Uh, shit, well, it's probably not that. Elf me. Elf me. It was called Crusade something. Nope. No, it was not. 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 Okay. Sung. It is PC adventure role playing. What if this is like an early Baldur's Gate? 
I'm I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Is that isn't that not okay? <laughs> what a yikes! Gauntlet Legends. Bro, this is okay. That's crazy. It doesn't have all my games. It's Odd World. <laughs> okay, it does have Odd World at least. Uh, I am playing. What if I just type Elf? Oh, this is big for us. This is big for us. I just need to get more. Give me a skip. Give me a skip. Give me a skip. A, a crow? A, a crow? Interesting. He got a big hand. Five fingers. This ain't AI. Wait, this gauntlet is so big and this gauntlet is so small. Am I just not seeing the, the forest for the trees? PC Adventure. This can't be like a Witcher or something. This isn't like Witcher 1. Fuck it, let's try it. Of course not. Of course not. Uh, 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 uh. What did we get? We got the center of his body. Hmm, he's got a potion of some sort. This isn't like Torchlight or something. No, it's an adventure game. Oh, man. Something Sworn? For Forsworn? No. God Sworn? No. Uh, there is a sun. It's daytime, but it's red, which is very interesting for us to notice. Uh, oh. Is that the Eye of Sauron? Is there a is there a evil Lord of the Rings game? Oh, it is hack and slash slash beat them up, dude. I knew that was a crow. I knew that was a crow. It is hack and slash Dynasty Warriors Gundam. I wish I could see this man's face, but I know that would give it away. It's hack and slash RPG adventure for PC. Hack and slash RPG adventure for PC. It's not God of War. It's not, is there like evil Prince of Persia? Prince of Persia, the Twilight Princess. Hmm. <laughs> what about that's not even really hack and slash, is it? Who makes hack and slash games? Anyone? I'm just, I'm not a hack and slash Andy is probably my biggest issue. To me, this looked like the Eye of Sauron, but I also could be straight up capping. Cause like, this is pretty brutal for a Lord of the Rings game. Bird. I don't think I'm going to get this one. Can you give me his face? Oh. The fuck is this? <laughs> he got a symbol on his head. <laughs> uh, chat, no spoilers. I'm going to ask you a question, and I'm going to look for one second. And my question is, am I fucked? Put your answers in the chat, please. I need everyone. Do not spoil it. <laughs> yes? Okay, then I'll just skip. I'll just skip. I'll, I'll take the L. Grim Dawn never would have got it in a million years. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I would have never guessed this. Maybe I typed the word Grim because it's so grim, but I have never played this game. I have never seen this game. I have no idea what we're talking about. Every so often, they just put out some weird shit. Oh, it is... What is this supposed to be? It's like a Diablo-like? I mean, it says 800,000 views. Power to him. Man, I almost guessed Torchlight, uh, which is also an action RPG, but I did not guess Torchlight because it's too cartoony for this picture. But maybe I, maybe I could have got somewhere. All right, we're starting with an L. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get the mini up. I have been told by the people that today's mini is sub 30 -able. That's what I've been told. Who knows? I lost. I lost the first one. 
Disagree? You think it's not sub 30 -able? Okay, then hey, guess higher. Guess higher. Generic ass medieval RPG. I mean, at least it's an ARPG, which is slightly different than all the generic medieval RPGs. You got one minute today? All right. Maybe I'm Magma Meg build. I popped off a four minute banger on the mini. Oh, that's yikes. That's Yikers Island. One minute on mini. I was slow today. Yeah. Even though I did the mini kind of quick, I can't bring myself to guess sub 30. I feel like yesterday I messed up the mini and people were like, oh, does this guy suck? And then I had the connections god line of my life. I was served a clip on TikTok yesterday of Northern Lion doing yesterday's connections. One, crazy he got it up so quickly. And two, that guy didn't know about the cat's pajamas. He said the cat's pillow? The cat's pillow? Come on, man. I actually think I want to convert my TikTok into just being me playing daily games. Now that would be sauce. He's just built different. I only knew Cat's Pajamas because of a song called that. Fair. Stan doesn't know about the Cat's Pillow. <laughs> the Canadian thing. It's a coming of age ritual in Canada. By the way, I know that we're going to do the mini and I shouldn't get too distracted, but have you guys seen the discourse about John Cena supposedly doing a humiliation ritual at the Oscars by walking out naked? People are absolutely crazy. That shit is so funny. Sometimes I wonder if New York Times is aware that connections, crosswords, etc. is updated via time zone. Uh, why? Why do you ask that? I'll tell you what, it didn't look humiliating to me, it looked hot. Yeah, it's like, oh no, an extremely ripped guy had to go out there and show off his body. And, and obviously not his wiener. <laughs> it's like, just his abs and stuff. Oh no. <laughs> I do a humiliation ritual every day, it's real. That was me drinking beer mixed out of that trophy. I was hoping that humiliation ritual would work for me. All right. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we've been struggling on the mini lately. It's been like uh, over one minute, three days in a row, I think. So let's just do this. Let's just do this. Get in. Uh, fair use. Um, sense. Uh, misbehave, a little suspicious, suspect, uh, ball, poor passer, no idea. No longer identify on social media, on, I don't know, hot guy, a stud, uh, sports award like best upset or best team, an ESPY. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Cash, and then we have something a bat listens, echo, and then we have misbehave, act up, uh, shady, and ball on, what is this one? Un tag. 39. Nice. A little slow. A little slow. Not bad, though. I, that, that could have been sub 30, but untag, really. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That was for believers? What was, the, what was the bet? I didn't actually get to see how you guys split it. Surprised you didn't bink ball hog? Sorry, was ball hog one of them? Oh, hog. Poor passer. Ball hog, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I, I don't know why. I couldn't figure that one out. But it was fine because we got there. Who up hog and they ball? <laughs> Majority, 30 sex to one minute one. Got it. Strands Gamba is up. Get in there. I heard that it is possible to get the Spangram first today. Yesterday was a tough Spangram. Today, we got it. Hog and SB had me stumped. Uh, SB is very American pilled, so I understand that. Fair use as a YouTuber also was like very easy for me. <laughs> so use sense. I probably could have got shady faster, but we got there. I like strands because I think like the best case scenario for strands looks so goaded. 
you just like bink a six Spangram and then you're like, because I know the category, boom, 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 boom. Like the one from two days ago. That was so sick. Uh, guacamole into dips. Stuff like that. I am autistic and have an aversion to change, but is strands really worth adding to my dailies? I like it. I mean, you can try it. You don't have to add it. Then it's not change. I always find the blue clues first, then I get an idea and find the Spangrim. That is a, a way to do it. Yeah, if you want Spangrim first, for sure. Strands becomes too easy once you get the hint. Then don't get the hint. I've never clicked hint in my life. Literally, it doesn't exist for me. Why would I be clicking hint? I want to find it. Ladies and gentlemen, strands me. Ruler's decree. Oh, a ruler's decree is... Ooh, ruler's decree, huh? Could be... Uh... I think, like, word made law would be insane. But there's no W's. Okay. A ruler's decree. Damn, what is this? Let's just try and find some. Let's just try and find some. I think law probably exists in here. Let's see. Ruler's decree. Word on high. Zoom in me. Make sure I'm not covering up any of the board. Boink. Let's just do this. Surf Remember, everything has to be used. Everything has to be used. So let's get this. Tree. Ruler's decree, huh? What is a ruler's decree? If I was the queen and I needed to tell my subjects something, a ruler's decree could be like a royal speech. It could be um, act of war or something. Could be could be big. It could be any kind of act. Emergency. E.M. No. E.M. No. What would we have here? Are you... Are you... Interesting. Ruler's Decree. What am I seeing here in my puzzle? Math. Oh. What? <laughs> Ruler's degree. <laughs> Math. Literature. There's no way. <laughs> Just seeing math is, is fucking me up. I need to I need to get out of that. I need to get out of that. Faith? No, no I. F A. I keep seeing this TY together and I want to do like tyranny or something, but it's not. A ruler's decree. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I am lost in the sauce here. Uh, mandate. M A, a mandate would be a ruler's decree. One, two, there's three M's. M A, M A. Not a mandate. Not a. It'd be crazy. Hmm. D? No. What if it is, what if a ruler's decree was, what could it be? 
It's not like forms of government or something. No, because it wouldn't. That wouldn't be a decree. The decree itself would be a law made, an act of war, a change to taxation. What What are things that rulers decree? Um, state religion. <laughs> there's There's like a lot of things that they decree. Unless there's like a subversion here. What if it's ruler, the object, and it decrees length? Whoa. Give me an L. Longitude. Long. <laughs> Long. <laughs> no. That would be that would be fucked. Where's my S's at? Right here. S. S. Okay. Okay. Song. We have math. We have song. We have... A uh, thief. There's lots of F's. Interesting. Sure. Cure. Cure. Do we have tincture? T-I-N-C-T-U-R-E? No, we don't. <laughs> it's not a ruler's decree, but it is a word that is long. Uh, 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 what else do I have here? N-E-Y, money? M-O, no. N-E-Y, knee. I think E-S is big. Let's let's try and find, like, ends of words. E-S, E-R, E-S. A tryst, you can't use that, would be like an affair. Oh, there we go. Tri no. <laughs> Tires. Uh, tears, like tier ones that are all subbing to my channel right now. Tears. What else do we have? We have a mire, like we had a, a quagmire in the Middle East during the Bush presidency. Does that help me at all? No, it doesn't. It does not help me at all. Uh, we have Dre. Remember what Dre said? Nothing, you idiots. Dr. Dre's dead. He's locked in my basement. Foot. Oh, it is a ruler's decree. Wait, is this foot? Inch. Inch me. Inch. Okay, it is It is exactly what I thought. That you... You tricksy little bitch. Okay, okay, okay. We have foot. We have inch. Uh, we probably have meter at some point here. Uh, M-E-T-E-R. We have, okay, we have foot. We have inch. We have meter. Uh, so it's measurement. M-E-A-S. M-E. No. M-E-A. M-E-A. Me measure. Mens. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Spangerman won. That's how we do it. And now I can do whatever I want. Now I can do foot. Now I can do yard. Now I can do inch. Now I can do meter. Now I can do... What the hell is this one? I don't know. Let's go over here. What other, what other kind of measurements are there? Meters, inch, feet, yards, miles. Uh, miles could be one for sure. Uh, long. <laughs> what the hell is this one? Ends with long. Distances. Leagues. 20,000 leagues in the sea. Or just league. Oh, and a furlong, like in a horse race. Uh, fathom. That's Is that what boats or submarines do? what i'm talking about baby that's what i'm talking about baby that's just that was just some good shit we stared at it we had to intuit it we figured out the subversion and then we got there what a beautiful fucking strand uh, who, whoever made that one you cooked i don't know who it was i wish they had their name here a fathom equals six feet i can hardly fathom that ah, good puzzle 
great puzzle even. Come on. I can't fathom Ludwig being 6'2". Well, that's just because that's a lie. <laughs> I would say that Ludwig is slightly under a fathom himself. Going big on 45k plus, that's crazy. Yesterday we got 44.5, and, and we did good. Ruler made me think Empire, so I spent so long looking specifically for Imperial units. That's fair. I spent a long time thinking about like what a Ruler's Decree could be, but I, I in the back of my head I had a feeling that there was something. Your dad doesn't shave his pubes, call that fur long. Technically, you got a 49.5 yesterday. Oh, <laughs> whatever you, hey, whatever you want to call it. Uh, that was the dumbest thing. <laughs> All right, we ready for connections? Ooh, the strands was nice. Yesterday was probably the easiest, uh, not the easiest, was the most well-played connections of my life. Let's see what we got today. Let's see what we've got today. Uh, scroink. I like being on the right side for some reason. Makes me feel comfortable. Uh, the Harlem Shake. A Boston cream pie. Wait, Harlem and Boston. Only two locations? Call her daddy. Chocolate Lab. Okay, wait. What if this is... Uh, what if this is like a, a food plus a thing? Chocolate Lab. Boston cream pie. Golden Hour, no. Rank Pit. Cherry Pit. Ch cherry Pit. Chocolate Lab. They would never do flavors that way, right? Because they would never do a purple where it's a different blank word. Hmm. Lab Coat. Tear. Wait, was Tear in Spangram? Sorry, was it Tear in Strands and this? That's fucked up. That's some real fucked up shit. If. If. With. Pit. Add a G. No. Add a B. No. Boston Baked Beans. Harlem. New York. Class Clown. Daddy Clown. <laughs> That's what they call me. Rank. And rank and file. Howl. What if this is people who were stranded on Gilligan's Island? Is that too deep a pull? Wasn't Dr. Dr. Howl, Mr. Howl? <laughs> Sorry, this show came out 70 years ago. Uh, the Division by Tom Clancy. Also, if and with. That just feels like something. And with also plus. Wait, is this just the easiest thing in the world? I'm going to go for it. This just seems so simple. Yeah. Including. I didn't know why they put a baby one in there. This is not even the easiest one? Excuse me? Okay. Uh, that was including. We have uh, Boston. Okay, wait. What if this is racist cities? Imagine. Class. We have um, class picture, class clown. Daddy. Daddy, huh? Now that one is fucking me up. Daddy Yankee, the artist. Boston, where the Yankees live. <laughs> Harlem, where the Yankees play? Wait, is there a Yankee thing here? <laughs> Fuck. That's crazy. I don't I don't think there is though. I don't, I don't think there is. 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 Daddy Yankee. The har the, the, no, 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 no. Howl. Howl is a thing wolves do. A thing dogs do? Oh, pit, lab. Wait, what if this is breeds of dogs? Golden. Uh, and a Boston. Boston Terrier. Pit Bull. These are, these are dogs, but are they right? I think it is. Dog breeds informally. Informally was the word I was looking for. Because I was like, what's not a purple? It ain't a purple, I'll tell you that much. All right, we only have four more, and we've used that. So a Harlem that is potentially not the city is just Shake, or 
I wonder if we could add a letter, remove a letter. Replace the last letter with a Y, you got a Harley. Replace the last letter with a Y, you got a Howie. <laughs> tier, peer. Uh, a, a cut above. Oh, rank, tier, class, and division. Perfect is a section. How old daddy Harlem if? Let me think about it. I know I have a perfect connections here. We've already done it, but I'm going to try and figure this out first. Harlem, Daddy, Howl, if. If Daddy Howl, Harlem. <laughs> if Howl, Harlem, Daddy. <laughs> what the fuck am I looking at here? Uh, okay. What, 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 what the hell am I looking at here? Harlem. Don't Wake Daddy, famous board game from when I was a kid. Howl. Howl. Okay, what if it is a homophone for a last name like Howl, H-O-W-E-O? -E no, definitely not. If at a G you get GIF, which is a picture. Um, What else do we have here? Harlem Daddy Howl If 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 this then that Howl me Harlem It's a Dutch word I think Or a Dutch city Howl. Things wolves do. Howl at the moon. Daddy at the moon. When you coming home, Dad, I don't know when. Is this uh, uh, famous locations in the song uh, Cats in the Cradle? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think it is. If. Is this. What is this going to be? I think I'm just gonna take my, my points. I think I'm gonna take my puntos and say, we didn't get purple today. Wait, owl? This is a, this is a bird. Arlen, uh, remove a letter to make a bird? No, because that doesn't work. Owl. Can we scramble? No, we can't scramble, we can't owl. Har if. What am I looking at here? Add? Wait, wait, wait. What about like add, multiply, subtract? No, there's not like math terms in here. Howl. Daddy Warbucks from Annie. <laughs> if. I don't got it. I apologize. I'm gonna I'm gonna take my points. Famous poems? Oh. I would have never gotten that, sorry. <laughs> Famous poems? I don't think I know any of these. Howl's my favorite poem, and the first thing I thought of when I saw it still don't get the category. I don't think it's dumb. I mean I just I just didn't know it. It's fine for me not to have knowledge. Stans doesn't even know the daddy poem. Recite it to me. Recite it to me if you know it. Happy birthday! It's my birthday. Chat, sing happy birthday! You're, aren't you supposed to get out of here? What the hell? You're wearing pajamas. You're supposed to be at work. It's nine o'clock. You're supposed to be at work. It's my birthday! It's my birthday! It's, birthday. <laughs> it's Rochelle's birthday. They're all saying happy birthday, and they're gifting so many subs and so much money. Oh my god! Thank you, chat. Wow. It's crazy. Oh, they're all excited about Chicago. Oh, yeah? Yeah, they said it's great. Oh, good. It's flames, yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's really good. It's really Happy good. 22nd birthday. Dude, if only. Flattery will Fuck get you it, nowhere. if only. <laughs> I'm old. Love you. Love you, too. I just wanted to birthday. Of course. Yes, happy birthday. Oh. Oh. My gift to Rochelle on this birthday. A 45K in connection. Enough fucking time guesser, baby. Let's get the gamma going. 
<laughs> Don't copy of me. Don't copy of me. That's a terrible present? No, that's a great present. The poem Daddy is by Sylvia Plath, and it's not too long to put in chat. Sylvia Plath from the Bell Jar fame? Dude, I'm Plath pilled. Wait, I'm Plath pilled. Oh. I have no idea what's happening in chat. Not a good present. You get her that every day. That shows my commitment. Uh, this is the poem. You do not do. You do not do. Anymore. Black shoe. In which I have lived like a foot. For 30 years. Poor and white. Barely daring to breathe. Or I chew. <laughs> Daddy, I have to kill you. I just... I, I am not... I apologize. This is not... Poetry is great. Poetry is great. That's all I'll say. I have no interest in going into this. Poetry is great, man. I, I'm glad you guys like it. And I think that you should enjoy it. <laughs> Hi, Stan. Can you please tell Rochelle I appreciated her flossing? Yeah. I'll tell her. I'll tell her. <laughs> I'll let her know for sure. Can we get some snaps in chat for that moving delivery? Ah, chew ah. Daddy, please die, die. Poetry is only cool in Dead Poet Society when Robin Williams makes it cool, otherwise it's dumb. <laughs> That's crazy take. Never heard someone rhyme ah chew before? Yeah, she's straight up Marshall Mathers pilled. She went straight off the door hinge. When I think of Plath, all I think about is how she offed herself by shoving her head in an oven. Yeah, not only that, but once you learn about the change from, I can't remember what book I was reading, the change from the kind of gas they used in their ovens then to now um, had such a significant impact on suicide rates of women in the UK that it is studied until today. It is a fascinating article. Uh, I wish I remembered where I read it. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Women were actually just f going nuts with those ovens because it was a, a painless way to kill yourself, like super fast, super chill. <laughs> and they didn't want to use guns. They didn't have guns and they didn't want to use guns. And so they changed the ovens and people just didn't kill themselves as much, of course. Your first thought might be like, oh, they'll just find a different way. The crazy thing, they didn't. They didn't find a different way. <laughs> That's how they got the name originally, because you would of in your head and of out the end. So true. Oh. It's almost like housewives were essentially imprisoned in their homes and were widely super unhappy. Yeah. Hell yeah. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, time guesser. Someone said it was really hard today. A bit worried, but we will see. All right, this is Marilyn Monroe above a grate. This is such a famous picture. I guess I always assumed it was New York, but isn't it more likely that it's Los Angeles? Because she's a movie star? Um, her real name, Norma Jean. Does that help? Does that give me bonus points? <laughs> Sorry, is it Norma, Norma Jean? That might not even be true. That might not even be true. Did any of you see the movie with uh, De Armas? De Armas? I never saw it. Okay, Stan's PR guy, him saying, hell yeah, after reading a chat about women being enslaved in the kitchen wasn't accurate. Sometimes his brain doesn't work. No, I'm saying that like, hell yeah, you're spitting, brother. Hell yeah. Dude, finally, someone speaking truth to power during Women's Month. It is? Okay, I'm going to give myself bonus points for knowing that's her name. Um, I actually know nothing about Marilyn Monroe. I, I truly, truly. I guess I'm kind of worried she's going to fall in. Which reminds me of... Do you guys ever have, like, something you saw as a kid that fucking changed your life and, like, really fucked you up? 
I had a bright orange VHS four episode collection VHS of Rugrats. And on that, there were two episodes that instilled in me fears that I kind of hold till today. One in which they get sucked down the drain and two in which they are having nightmares and he turns around and goes, I'm not Stu. That I'm not Stu shit will fuck you up. It'll fuck you up. I'm not Stu. Rugrats. This, I, I still have nightmares about this. You know what I'm talking about? Dude, Spike is like talking. This, this is not for children. It's like Spike is not supposed to talk because he's a dog. Dude, if he said he's a dog there, I would have vomited because it would have literally just been in my brain from then. I'm not Tommy was also freaky. Stu, I didn't know you were coming over. Oh, that's so fucking creepy. That's so creepy and weird, man. I'm sorry that Norma Jean here reminded me of that, but just seeing her maybe getting sucked in the grate did it. Uh, ugh, I haven't watched that since I was maybe like six. That's fucking me up. Tell me this doesn't look like Brendan Fraser preparing for his role in The Whale. Dude, is this Brendan Fraser's grandpa? Are you, do, you, do you see what I'm seeing? That shit looks just like him. Costume jewelry. I think I'm gonna say New York, even if it's wrong. I think this is probably LA, but to me, this is like a famous New York scene. And she would be walking by, probably, um, where the shows are. Where are the shows? I always do this in New York. I don't actually know where anything is. If I was a show guy, I would be Radio City Music Hall, Garment District, Madison Square Garden. Isn't it like right here? COVID-19 testing site. Maybe not. I thought it was right across from this tunnel. So I thought it would be like right here. Maybe not. No, that's Times Square. Maybe the tunnel down here. I thought it was across from a tunnel. Nah, I'm actually smoking big dink doinks. Okay, what am I looking for? I'm looking for Broadway. Broadway. Broadway is somewhere. That's cool looking. Park Avenue, the Flatiron Building, the Museum of Sex, the Rubin Museum of Art. Swingers. Barstool Sports 7-Eleven. I think I'm just going to rock it up here. I, I don't really know. What if she's just chilling straight up on 6th Avenue? Right by the right by Radio City Music Hall. There's nothing I can use. Costume jewelry. God, that makes me think it's LA, though. That makes me think it's LA. Oh, Wicked. Here's theaters. Broadway. I found it. I don't know why I think it's Broadway. I just kind of do. Fuck it. And then she is dead is the thing about her. She would have been that age in... I'm trying to think of all those fucking MySpace chain messages that you would put on your wall that were like, if you don't like me at my worst, you don't deserve me at my best. And it's a picture of Marilyn Monroe. It's not even a picture of Marilyn Monroe. It's not. It's a picture of... Um, Audrey Hepburn. Damn, that... You ever actually dig in your brain? Like, you ever physically scoop stuff out of the way and then you get there? That's Aubrey Hepburn I'm thinking of. Shit, I'm conflating. I don't let that affect my time periods here. There was a movie about her. With De Armas. And in it... God, it felt like... Oh, this camera's old as shit. I mean, am I crazy in saying the... 40s? I really have no idea. 
Don't say anything. I'm, I mean, I'm not looking at chat, but don't say anything anyway. 50s? 1950? Is this like quintessential 1950? What are the, what's the, what's America going through? I wish I could see a car. What kind of car would she be getting in after this, you know? I think it's a little older. I'm going to go 1945. When did Wizard of Oz come out? Didn't we? Wizard of Oz came out. Wizard of Oz came out during World War II. This this is around the same time as Wizard of Oz. Is that Does that make sense? Maybe even 42 then. Is this a fit, able-bodied man? Wouldn't have he have been drafted, though? <laughs> Wouldn't he have been drafted? Fuck, I'm going 45. I'm just going to lock it in because I think I'm bad at this. I think I'm bad at this. 54. Oh, not bad. 54. Marilyn Monroe posing on top of the updraft from the New York subway grates during filming for the seven-year itch. You were nine years off. Wizard of Oz was like 20s or 30s. Uh, sorry, I'm in chat now. Was that, Is that true? I thought it was 30... I thought it was like 39. I saw a TikTok recently that said Wizard of Oz was released during World War II. You know what I mean? Can someone tell me? Can someone verify when Wizard of Oz? But maybe that was wrong. Maybe it was just not, or maybe it was pre-World War II. It was 39. It was 39. That is, my logic follows. My, lo my logic follows here. We use the Wizard of Oz to triangulate here. <clears throat> I would have guessed 42, but if this was a picture of the Wizard of Oz, I would have been within three years, and that's pretty good. All right, I'll take my 75. Hello? Uh, fucking whoever makes these goddamn Icelandic Norwegian time guessers needs to fucking bury their head in the sand. Ah. <sighs> I hate these. I hate these. Every week it's just like, don't know the difference between Norway and Iceland? Yeah, I don't. I don't, man. All right? Is that what you want? Is that what you want to hear? Nordbein? All right, we're going Norway. I'm, I'm actually just straight up going Norway. You know why? Red middle, blue outside, Norway. Blue middle, red outside. Wait, is that wrong? This is blue outside. I'm going Norway. I'm going Norway. 1906. Get fucked. <laughs> Something Henriksen Tonsberg. Smegelfligger. 1906. Okay, well. Get fucked on that one, buddy. Uh, Joe. Henriksen Tonsberg. Oh, is Tonsberg a, a place? Trondheim a Bergen? No, what is... Sorry, let me... What is my, my cursive? That's a G, right? What the hell is that supposed to be? Oh, that's, no, that's an E. I see it now. Eme Berefig. Figif. Eme Berefigif. Eme Berefigif. Yeah. Don't you know? What? No, let's just be mean to people from Norway for some reason. I don't know why I'm doing this. Henriksen... Tonsberg. I think Tonsberg. So, Berg is like town or city. So I feel like we're in Tonsberg, not Tonsbergen. Can I talk? Is there a Tonsberg in Iceland? <laughs> don't do this to me. Don't do this to me now. No. In fact, the names of these places don't even make sense. The, the names in this place don't even make sense. There's no way this is like a Norwegian pride celebration in Sweden or something, right? No. Tonsberg me. Sandford. Kyrgyzstan, Rogaland, Kopervi, Bergen, Alicent, Hamar, Oslo. Where the fuck Tonsberg at, bro? Tron time, like the guy from fucking Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Weebs know what I'm talking about. Get in. Hoo, 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 hoo. Uh, I can't find Tonsberg. Is it a T? That's a T. Tonsberg. Tonsberg. Maybe outside of Oslo? Kongsberg? 
Sarpsburg, Sonsford, Sonsburg, Oppegard, Tonsford me. Dude, I know we can get this. We can get a 10k here. What time is it? Uh, 15. Tonsburg, 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 Tonsburg. Do the Tonsburg shake, you know what I'm saying? Let's look outside of Trondheim. No, there's not shit up here. I think we're going south. We're also not seeing as many bergs up here, if that means anything. I feel like bergs start Oslo and down. I feel like this is Bergville. If Shake Drizzle lived somewhere, it'd be down here, next to the bergs. Oh, Tonsberg, found it. Oh, fuck yeah. Holy shit. Wait, we're crushing. Tonsberg 1906, well, I mean, let's just find Old Town. Damn, straight up, I think this is a uh, 10k. Ooh, woo. 9997. I was a block away. That's huge. That's huge. Crowds gathering to meet the Queen of Norway, Maud of Wales, on the streets of Tonsberg. There's a McDonald's there now? No, there's a praline and stuff. There's no McDonald's. Unless you mean down here. There's a Burger King down here. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, there's a McDonald's there. This photo is a cheat code for Norwegians. I mean, this photo is a cheat code for everyone because it literally says the city and the date. As long as you know that either, like, these words are uh, you would find in Norway or these flags, like, you'll be fine. Oh, shit. Amelia Earhart taking off from Kitty Hawk. Well, that's a good one. Uh... Maybe. I actually don't know where she took off from. <laughs> Why do I think... Is this even Amelia Earhart? <laughs> There's a mountain. <sighs> what am I thinking? The Wright brothers. We're technically from Ohio, but the there's two states. Here's the problem. Let me tell you my problem. I'm going to tell you a little bit of trivia that will elucidate the problem that I am having right now. And that is that there are two states that claim that they are first in flight. Okay? And it's, it's really fucked up. You have Ohio that claims they're first in flight. And maybe has a little bit more credence based on the fact that the majority of astronauts historically come from Ohio. And then there is another state. I believe it is North Carolina that also considers itself first in flight. And if I was taking off on an around the world journey, I would probably be leaving closer to a coast. Maybe, maybe not. She also, did she go down to the Bermuda Triangle or is this just a fake, is that fake fucking news? I think, uh, I think it's North Carolina because I think Charlotte, I think Charlotte claims it. And is there like a mountain range around here? How flat? What do they do? They grow tobacco. Does this look like a tobacco field? Big mountain. Maybe it's this. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? Maybe this isn't her taking off. Maybe this is someone landing. Maybe this isn't even Amelia Earhart. This could be a whole different country. These people actually don't look that American. They kind of look British. But would the British let a woman fly? I feel like the British are somehow even more sexist. That's probably not true. They're probably equally sexist. Damn, this guy's feeling the fucking fire. Oh... Looking at what are these uniforms? These uniforms are kind of fucking me up. This guy kind of looks like Jordan Peterson. Fuck. I don't know. What is this? Okay. 
this is a mountain. And I feel like the UK don't have mountains. I feel like famously when I meet people from the UK, they come to the US and they go, holy shit, you have so many mountains. And so I am not going to do that. I am going to pick the US, even if it's a fuck up. I also see a, a, a buy prop plane here, if that means anything. Shout out to my buy props out there. Anything on that? No. I think I'm going to guess outside of Charlotte, North Carolina. I think that's what I'm going to do. It could be wrong. That's okay. That's okay because I just feel it a little bit. There's a mountain back there. This is probably wrong. But I think I'm down with being wrong. Let's learn something. You know what? Let's learn something today. How about that? Wouldn't that feel nice? Wouldn't it? And then year-wise, I mean, this is some early shit, man. This is some early shit. Nineteen twenty. It's a nice plane. It is Amelia Earhart greeting crowds as becoming the first female aviator to fly solo across the Atlantic Ocean. She flew from Newfoundland to Londonderry, Northern Ireland. It's Ireland. Damn. It was Amelia Earhart. I was right about that. I just, she was landing, which is why they were celebrating. They are not seeing her off. They are celebrating her arrival. Her final mission started in Oakland. California? Really? I lived there. I never knew that. That's crazy. Damn. Why'd she land there? Dude, don't ask me. Okay, well, that's brutal. Could not have gotten worse on location. 1932. And it's definitely later. I probably should have known based on how modern this engine looks, but that's on me. Ah, oh, tough round. Gonna be real tough to pull this one out. In fact, it's impossible to go 40K after that. Damon Freezer Salon. Photo droguery. People. Oh, shit. What is this flag? Black and white flags that are colored really fuck me up. What is this supposed to be? Sometimes I think this is orange, white, and green, but I think I might have made that same mistake last time, and it's technically red, which means it's a different country. I think last time I saw a similar flag, I was Netherlands pilled, but then I, because I thought it was blue, but it turned out to be orange. And if it's orange, what does that mean for me? Universa something, Buckhardem. I mean, language-wise, it looks like, does that say workers? That's English? Something coffee workers? What am I looking at here? Dude, lots of old pictures today. Brutal world today. So much English is kind of fucking me up. This roof might have architecture that I should be able to intuit. Freezer. Okay, cobble streets plus hill. Kind of a gate looking thing. That's the entrance of the building. Hmm. By not knowing this photo spelled F-O-T-O and drogery, I have to assume is like drugstore. This is a drugstore and photo place, but the language. So it's not German, because I feel like it wouldn't be drogery. It would be like, un drogenstoren. You know what I mean? It's like a long ass word. So maybe not Germany. What is this flag? Kana Tavel. Kana Tavel? Sorry, was that a Kond? Kond Tavel? Sorry, my eyes don't work. Established in 1877. <laughs> so it's post 1877, if that helps. Shh. 
Chad something. Cafe. So many cafes. Reveal yourself, flag. Wait, are these the same flag? They must be, but man, the color looks different in this photo, huh? Darker on top. This one looks darker on top too. Is there any chance there's alternating flags? No, because that wouldn't be alternating. What am I thinking? I'm thinking non-Germany. We've gotten Prague a lot. We've gotten Vienna a lot. Zurich. Budapest? I feel like we're I feel like we're on the map here. I feel like we are in this zone. Maybe even Slovenia. Dragory makes me think even Croatia? Uh-huh. Austrian flag, Austrian flag. Dig, dig into your mind palace. Bergenland. That's twice we've gone burger pilled. Zagreb. Nah, ending with G's though is nice. No, 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 no. Why is there so much English? That's really what's freaking me out, man. Burke hard long. Burke Burke hard long. <laughs> What the fuck is that? Ooh, what if we're in Romania or something? No. No. Bucharest? No, I've been Bucharested too many times. Not enough accents. Not enough accents on letters. Bratislava? Didn't we get a Bratislava once? Not enough accents again? And also, maybe too much English? Where would I be English-pilled? I think by not knowing these flags, I'm kind of setting myself up to fail. Maybe I'll just go with my original gambit. Is Vienna? No. No, maybe... Maybe? This one could be bad. This one could be bad. Coffee with a K, huh? Does her dress tell me anything? God damn, that looks so stereotypical German to me. Could this be like an old German flag? What did they use before they used this fucking red, yellow, and black one? Or brown, whatever it is. They used like a fucking eagle. They had the, the goddamn empire. Okay, so it's not that. <sighs> oh, excuse me. Sorry, Kavi hasn't kicked in yet. It's a little too hilly for the Netherlands, in my opinion. Because uh, that country is famously flat, which is why they had to build all the dikes. Am I just in Prague? Am I in Bruges? Lots of Z's. Ah, too many Z's, maybe? Too many Z's, too many accents. Too many Z's, too many accents. I need, like, a more Americanized. <sighs> no. Budapest me? Too many accents, too many Z's. No, 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 no. This is more Western, dude. People are also white as hell. Truthfully, I actually have no idea. 
I think this is just gonna have to be a wild guess. I, I think I could get zero points on this one. Um, my gut, I'm gonna go Salzburg. And I am going to guess... Where's that hill? Coming down from one of these hills into downtown. My mom's. And I'm going to guess... Is that a car down there? Maybe not. Damn, this shit old as hell. Got a lot of old pictures today. Uh, there's drugstores. There's photos. And it feels like you can develop your own photos, which maybe tells us something about the time. I don't know what it tells us, but I do think it does tell us something. This guy's got a nice suit. That backpack doesn't place it. All of their shoes are old. Plus, no cars. I mean, I think I think we're like a... Are we in 1905? Is that crazy to say? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> 58. 58. Yeah, that, I don't know. That was literally brutal. 53 years off and it was Germany. What is the flag? Sub 35K is going to make bank. It can be a city flag too, I guess. Is it? Was it? Do you guys know? German flag? What? Hello? Wait, you're trying to tell me that's bl that's black, red, and yellow? No. Could be the flag of Marburg? I hope it's not. I'm not I'm never gonna learn city flags. I think it is. I think it's this, but without the crest, maybe? No. Fifty-eight was also when Germany was two countries. I see. I think it's this. What if it's just a banner? It could just be a banner, but then they got me. Man, I was so far off on the year. I should have known by their hairstyles, I guess. That was brutal. Wristwatches were only worn by women till World War One, generally. Really? That's crazy. That's crazy. The other flag looks Austrian. Oh, so you think it is two flags? Didn't I guess? In Austria? Uh, none of those look Austrian to me. Oh, you mean this middle one, maybe? One of the flags is definitely Austrian. Oh, so my guess of Austria close to Germany isn't that terrible. I think location-wise, I don't feel bad. Austria is pretty far away, though. Not from Germany. I mean, how am I supposed to know it's Marburg versus Munich, you know? You thought Austrian or Dutch? Yeah. I thought Austrian, and I was wrong. World War II popularized Ritz watches for men because they use them for everything. I see. You live and you learn. All right, chat, this is sub 35K. If that's the lowest, that's the lowest. I Yeah, that's brutal. That's, that's brutal, man, and I am sorry. Okay, the rooftop, the Korean people uh, during the LA riots in, uh, sorry, this should not be that hard, on Western Avenue, uh, holds, sorry, I went way too far, would be, uh, what, where, where am I, where am I thinking, like right around here, right, where's Western, bye, have a good day, uh, make sure you get home early, all right. Mm -mm -mm. This one's so much easier compared to the others. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> I mean, I can still fuck this up. Oh, it's 5th Street and Western. I mean, this one literally has the cross streets. So eventually we can just go on 5th Street until we connect with Western. <laughs> uh, presumably. Which I think was right around here. Maybe. 5th Street, Harbor Way. Maybe not. Does 5th Street not even go through? Oh, no. 6th Street. What am I looking at? There's the Mutual National Life Building. What's crazy is I know I've, like, driven by this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Where is it? 
find Korean restaurants. Maybe that would help me. Where did I go to eat Korean restaurants? Like right, I feel like right here. Am I smoking weed? Filipino town? I guess not. Maybe it's more south? Little Armenia, Westlake, MacArthur. Is it further south than I think? South Central. I'm losing my mind. What the fuck? Little Tokyo, Arts District, Fashion District, Produce District. I thought it was right here. Am I smoking dink doinks on a level never before seen? No, south of Loyola Marymount University. We're not trying to go to law school. We don't give a shit about that. Maybe it is further south than I thought. We know it's on Fifth Street. We know it's on Fifth Street and Western. Fifth Street me, Fifth Street me, Fifth Street me, Fifth Street me. I live in this city. I live in this city. What am I doing here? Sixth Street? Fifth Street me. Central. Fifth Street me. Hold. Checker. San Pedro. Wall Street. San Julian, Maple, Los Angeles Street. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. Harlem, Broadway, Hill, Olive, Grand, Flower, Figueroa. What is happening here? What is happening to me? What is happening to me? Fifth Street, me? It's got to pop up again, no? Maybe it's just further west than I think. Ah, Korean stuff. Thank, thank the Lord. Thank the Lord for Korean stuff. This one Korean thing? Please give me more than one Korean thing. Western. I'm trying to think of where the exit is for Western off like the 10 or the 5 or something. Help me. Western, thank God. And it is the Carl's Jr. Okay, great. So if Carl's Jr. is on that corner, let's orient ourselves. That's Carl's Jr. We are across the street once and twice. We are right on top of the Imperial Cleaners and Laundry. We found it. Now, this happened during the riots in Los Angeles, which was what? Rodney King, which was... Why can't we all just get along? Which was... I mean, I'm late 80s, right? Is, is this an 88 vibe? Am, am I way off? Can I tell by cars? Was this 90s? <laughs> World Cup. What year, though? What year, though? I'm, I think I could be crazy. Should I put 90 just to be safe? I already beans it. I mean, we're, we're just trying for 30K today. We had a bad day on Rochelle's birthday of all days. Uh, is there anything I write? Do they have wristwatches? Did you know that men didn't wear wristwatches until World War II? <laughs> I mean, this is 5K off just location, so I just have to get close. I think I'm just going to go... I think I'm just going to go 88. I feel good. 92. Hey, the year I was born. Okay, I'll remember that now. Korean supermarket employees protecting their store from looters. Oh, how was I on the wrong side of the street? Um, buddy? I don't think so. Um, buddy? Unless they moved the Carl's Jr. Am I crazy? Maybe Carl's Jr. moved? Moving across the street would be crazy. <laughs> that one guy's wearing a mask, clearly 2020. You know what's crazy is someone might have just insta gone for that. 9300. Whew! That doesn't make sense with the map. I mean, yeah, unless Carl's Jr. moves, but I really feel like it was this and not this. Although, if it was a grocery store, maybe it was. Location still max score. Yeah, I'm actually talking a lot of shit for something that was basically perfect. Maybe they clicked over here. All right, final score for the mods. I apologize. Oh, 30. Honestly, we pulled that one out of a nosedive. Amelia Earhart, famous for flying around the world. That's tough. She flew so many places. What do you even want? She flew so many places. <laughs> oh, happy March 12th.